girls, we are back with another sneaker shopping video. This time we are in San Antonio for this video and outside you can see we're starting at the uh, Cavenders Boot City. It's a joke, we're actually waiting for Uber right now. I do wanna remind you guys we are giving away five pairs of Air Force Ones for only a dollar each. You can find more info on that down below in the pinned comment or visit our website, commonhypeaz.com. It'll be on the front page. All you gotta do is subscribe to our email and text messaging platforms. Drew worked very hard on it and uh, you'll begin text message and marketing emails directly from Drew. So that's all you gotta do to enter that. But uh, we're gonna start at a store called True North, uh, which is one of the stores that our homie Marcus Howard shops at when he's in San Antonio. So we're gonna start there and we'll see where the rest of the day leads us. All right, so just pulled up outside True North. Looks like our type of vibe where it's just like in like one of these plazas with the sign over. So not a mall front, but I know they do a lot of sales and they push a lot of weight here in San Antonio. So let's go in and check it out. Push that P, push and P. All right, so they've got some crazy stuff here. First thing off the bat that Bryce and I noticed were the cause figures. And we're just running just, you know, simple numbers in our head. They've got like a $100,000 cause collection, not only right here behind the register, but also up to now. But a couple of bear bricks up there as well. They have, I've never seen a store with this many Supreme decks. Apparently they move them. I was telling Drew that Supreme uh, illegal business called set. I wanted that skateboarding longest time just to display in my room because my homie Chris had it. Uh, never ended up pulling a trigger, glad I did it, but uh, that was just one of my girls right when I was getting into the Supreme and Secret game for a while. Drew just told us he really wants the Supreme Petra's mask. Little does he know, back in the girl restock days, I had, we, we, we couldn't get rid of him. Chris and I couldn't get rid of him. We would have just gave it to Drew had we known. Drew's also never seen uh, the Life of Pablo tour picture with him right there, so Drew was just drooling over that. The thing about the collectibles and a lot of this older Supreme stuff, even some of these tees back here, there's a lot of stuff, like Brandon can go find almost any shoe out there, but when it comes to Supreme and some of the collectibles, you just, you gotta know someone or you just have to be in the game for a long time. Um, so clearly someone here definitely has the right connections and has kept some good relationships with the right people. We were chopping it up with them, very cool people over here. Um, if you guys are in the area, make sure to check them out. But this is genuinely the craziest collectible collection, basically, I, I mean, I can think of. So like, for example, out in Arizona, we have like a Wang's Closet, which is basically kind of this vibe with some collectibles and stuff. Um, and this is what kind of Wang's was back in our day. They had a bunch of Supreme now. Now they've kind of transitioned to more of the heat stuff and Wang's and Cell have a bunch of this stuff, but just the cause figures alone and, and, and the decks and everything, it's, it's really great. We're talking about like selling it wise, it's a little tougher, but it's just cool to see. And there are people out there that are gonna come spend money on it. Yeah, there's probably one of you watching this like, wow, I gotta yeah. hit about it. It's, it's a very niche it. market. Not only that, but the Supreme pieces behind. I mean, the purple Gucci main team, not only is that one of the rare, rare colors, but just authenticating all this stuff because there's so many fakes, as well as the Kate Moss, like, it's it's wild. I sold my Gucci main Supreme tee. Yeah, I did not. That was a good tee too. And then the pinball machine, um, I saw that this was like a friends and family one on uh, one of uh, our boys' stories, and it's like an eighty thousand dollar pin pinball machine. Like the dog. I mean, you got stuff like this over here. You should sell like that. I'm starting to see some older SBs over here. Some pretty cool colorways as well. That is gangster. Slate blues. Yeah, those are tough. Teal wars. You don't see these often. Yeah. You just bought a pair of these bricks. Wow. <laughs> Oh these God. are wild. I've not seen a pair of these in forever. I used to have them. Did you? Yeah. Did you sell? How much did you sell them for back then? Do you remember? Not as much as probably. No, 950. Like yeah. These are some of the coolest cars. The laying down one? That's like Drew when he goes out to network. That's how he comes home. Mm -hmm. He ends up like that, and I really want to get him one. <laughs> but yeah. Other than that, guys, just a bunch of collectibles, some more decks up here. I think it's cool that every like, most of the decks they have, they have the full sets in collections so they can display them together. Um, but all this stuff is for sale. They're all price tagged. They just use them as display until they sell. So really good first stop. Great first stop. Showing out for San Antonio. All right, insert the cool pictures for the transition into the next door. Common hype. That's right. Look us up. I'll do it. I'm sure you'll exit out of the 10 seconds, first 10 seconds. I'll but subscribe, I'll like, and I'll let you, you know. <laughs> hey, he gets it. Around. Yeah. Maybe even throw a comment. Yeah, if you throw a comment, just make sure you make a note that you were our Uber driver. That would be hilarious. We'll, we'll get a good laugh. We would totally get a good laugh out of that. What's your name? Mike. Mike? What do you want me to uh, comment? Anything? Whatever I want to? What, hey, whatever your heart desires, you can comment it. I dropped the three sneaker guys off at a gay bar in San Antonio. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's hey, it. Drop your cash out, dude. Yeah, <laughs> we'll let you win it. Yeah. We give away $25 a video. 
So if you, you know, that'll be the funniest comment, and you're gonna get 25 bucks. I don't wanna offend anybody. <laughs> How do you like it here? It's been good so far. It's great. Yeah? Yeah. It's not too It's a little, it's a little Are you old. guys from Phoenix or Tucson or? Phoenix. Phoenix? No, not Tucson. <laughs> Absolutely not. ASU grads? ASU. Well, one, one of us graduated from college. Yeah. The other two How many ASU drop out? <laughs> you are? Yeah. Community college drop out. Too much time at the sororities for these two. A lot of f in Phoenix, I'll tell you that. <laughs> Okay, next door we're at is a store called Countdown USA. Looks like we got a guy. Yeah, absolutely. We'll take a pic. Give us one second. Let me do this intro real quick. This van right here. You're wondering why are we looking at a van right now? Well, earlier I saw Scotty, Larry, and Ian's stories on Instagram from Private Selection, and they've been riding around in this van. So you think they'll let us go with them? Yeah, no. We've been riding around in Ubers all day <laughs> since we can't afford this rental van yet. Or but, uh, chains. Or yeah. Maybe one day, but uh, right now let's go see. Hey, but we just met Mike. Yeah, yeah we did okay. just meet Mike say, in the Uber Don't though. forget about Mike. And Mike, Mike is probably a... watching this video since he said he was. So we're gonna look for Mike's comment. And if Mike does comment on this video, I hate to say it to you, uh, but uh, he's gonna win the $25 cash out for this video. God, he's got a comment. If you, that man was yeah, if, and if you do see his comment, be sure to like it so we can see it. And just, just bring it to the top of the comment. Is there anything that you think we can use in there? Just to experience Mike or? I don't know. I don't know. There's I hope you guys yeah, were able to see it. If you guys just came from it or get to go see it next. There's a lot of bleep. Just take it all in. Bleep. All right? bleep. There's a lot happening. What's up, man? How are you? Uh, what's your name? John. John? Yeah. Brandon, nice to meet you. Hey, what's up hey, to the YouTube? How are you doing? Damn, I saw y'all video tomorrow, but I was scared if y'all weren't coming to take a con. You were scared that we weren't? No, if y'all weren't coming. Oh, yeah, I was yeah. kind of guessing, like, yeah. We are here now. Right, let's, let's grab this. Yeah, paper. please take a photo. We're about to bust the pack. Did we win the sneaker yet? Oh, did that already get taken? Nah, it's, uh, it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. Yeah, that's the last spot. <laughs> Everybody spot. wants your side of the story. Bro, they've been following us. They were at the food court. All of them were just standing around waiting. We can tell there's guys at journeys, people <laughs> hiding. Like, like, some girl or some woman that took was off and was driving her son around the city to get it. Some dude just climbed under your van. I think he's gonna trail you guys. Right. Boy Joe pulled up on me. We just pulled up to the store and he goes, hey, I got something for you in the back. So I'm, I'm sitting here changing my camera equipment, pulls out with the No Fear Dragon tee. That is so tough. You guys know I just got some new ink. Oh, it's up here, but you guys can see the tail of the dragon, but it's basically the same Japanese dragon right there. Had to get my boy right. I really appreciate that, brother. Thank you. No problem. Here you go, bro. There it is. You got a, like a vintage page or anything? Uh, yeah, so um, Countdown SA Vintage, is, I run the vintage page for them. Okay. So uh, usually I go out in like warehouses and stuff like that, events, and pick out clothes, handpick. Sweet, bro. Yeah, yeah. so give yeah, us a follow. Make sure you guys go check them out. I really appreciate that. See yeah, the fifth pick soon, brother. Thank you again. Yeah. I really appreciate it. Appreciate y'all by, bro. Yes, sir. Well, you, you've been looking at this tee, G. Yeah, it's a fire tee. It's pretty stupid tee. <laughs> it's a little big, though. It is a big, big, but it's like, I mean, you can wear it as Yeah, yeah. in yeah. summer or whatever. Yeah. It's a vibe. And be you on the camera? Wow. We'll see how this one comes Is this the segment? Yeah. <laughs> or, no, no. That's tomorrow. You can't be that's a segment. Tomorrow. You, you don't love all people that give to you. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you know I mean? you do, but I yeah, do. that's it's your criminal activity, not mine. A lot of Texas vintage cheese in here, obviously. Yeah. You've been wearing so many hoodies, I barely remember you getting this tattoo. This? Yes. I oh see, yeah. I see it every day when he wakes up. Oh my god. <laughs> Yesterday, for example, somebody came and sold us a Union Dunk saying they found out about us through the Common Hype. So I appreciate you guys. Yeah, much appreciation on that. I'm sure for this guys. one too. Look at the Common Hype sticker right there. There we go. We got you. Damn. Look at that. I'm you, it's only right, yo. We always have appreciation for y'all. I have to find a personal today. <laughs> I, I might need another hat from you. Are you going to have hats tomorrow? Yeah. Bro, mine's off the beat. Trying to take it back to the future, bro? I'm trying to be the future. <laughs> Let me let him up for you. All right, so I got this tea right here. I'll try to Trade for a tee. <laughs> what size are they? Uh, uh, size 10. Size 10, 10 huh? How much? 35,000. That's it? Yes. I'll have my car shaped here. We'll trade <laughs> Would I wear them? Like, yeah, bro. I couldn't wear those. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You, uh, you just have to. Or else I just put $35,000 in cash and set it up somewhere and just look at it. I'd rather look at the money. That's just a sneaker conflict. That's all it is. Yeah. Yeah. Damn, yeah, boys, they got some heat right here. My row. It's got the lace packs that some pairs came with, some pairs didn't. Yeah. See, you don't know about sevens, but you gotta know about those sevens right there. We're trying to get them all. I'll tell you now. Someone came in to work one day and ripped that off. 
You're gonna find it. This is a great one for sure. Really? Absolutely, bro. These are so expensive. Though. Looks like Michael Jackson did the. <laughs> Damn, and they got all the Oregon PEs. That's my boy. Have you seen this shit before? Oh, those are Tokyos? These are. You know, for the longest time, I did not know this said 23. They're probably gonna roast me for this, but I didn't know for the longest time. It's a 23 in there, bro. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you about to come school me? No, I'm just gonna listen. He's gonna buy, he's gonna buy all yeah, this. Guy's gonna yeah. Yeah. So we got this Air Man right here. Where? 35k. How do you feel about it? You guys take a firm here? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's always four easy Yeah, payment. four easy payments four of 12 grand a pop. Yeah. <laughs> you only used to see on like when they would go to the actual college facilities and do the tours or if like you guys were on perfect pair a long time ago where you saw most of these older pairs so uh, you just have people see them now so it's crazy to see these happen. have a seat now if you don't know these actually do recline tico turn the turn the car on real quick my new boss right here in here v-dog let me show you what it's like to be an executive you guys are hiring right <laughs> now, now imagine just cruising along and just telling captain where you want to go tell him where you want to go uh, let's Cap go Captain to, uh, Tico. I need Bottle Blonde, Dallas. <laughs> well, what's cool is we got screens in the front, screens in the back. Let me get my office. Step into my office. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Step into the office, bro. <laughs> let's go get in our Uber now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Where's the man. Prius? <laughs> Alright boys and girls, we're at the, what mall is this? Riverside? River Center? Riverdale? Alright, we're at the Riverside Mall, I think it's called. Just left a couple other stores, trying to hit the last store of the day. Pretty cool mall so far. The ride probably gets you some good photos, so you guys can see those in the transition, but see how the rest of the days goes. You never know what's gonna happen with the boys. You so. never know. Just make sure you're watching the rest boys of the Boys eat some food right now. Yeah, though. I'm starving, dude. What's that? Yeah, sure, let's do it. Wow. Gotta subscribe. Wow, we're literally filming right now. Bro. What do you got on, G? Some more food. Let's go. Certified celebrity right there. All right, you heard? Okay, last stop of the day, we're here in the Riverdale Mall, River Center Mall, whatever it's called, uh, here at Stockroom. So just to kind of give you guys a glimpse, the first thing that caught our eyes, and specifically Drew's eyes, is that FaZe Clan Bear Brick. Drew's a diehard FaZe Clan uh, fan. So they've got tons of toddler shoes here. Uh, they said it's a consignment store, so they run at a 10% consignment rate. They do all their clothing in bags. So usually with consignment shops, you'll see a bunch of them wrap their sneakers. They make sure all the clothing is in these nice clothing display hanger thingy, my bobbers, whatever what you want to call them. A glimpse of kind of what they have over here. You got bread toes, you got starfish. Looks like bigger size stuff. Pam ones looks like they sell a lot of retros and they sell a lot of bins which it seems to me like a lot of mall fronts sell a lot of mids. Drew found this really cool OVOT. Straight OVOT. So tough, dude. Just a lot of baby shoes. I'm assuming if you're in a mall front, you were probably selling in a bunch of kids' shoes, just because I know parents love spoiling their kids. Uh, but 125 bucks for some Jordan, little Jordan 6 UNCs, you can't beat it. You got a bunch of threes, fours, five, sixes, uh, got four 11s. Uh, looks like they have a little bit of slide, some cheap, some Premier Air Force Ones. For the most part, just like the top selling shoes uh, for us and on apps and stuff. That is what they got. Bryson, you actually used to have a pair of these. I did. The dude, I actually remember you having. I'm not gonna lie. I looked at him and I was like, now worth a check. Yeah. These are the really hot cakes right now. These Paisley Dunks. So they have a blue color, a black color, a green color, and then I think there's like an unreleased like mustardish color. It's like an orange too. Yeah, and an orange. So Paisley Dunks, I mean, they're gonna hit. Paisley's really in right now. So that's fire. That's gonna wrap up the sneaker store stuff and we'll uh, transition to the next clip now. All right, so we're here with Neeks. He has a YouTube channel. I'm not sure if you guys have ever seen Neeks. If you have not, you gotta check out his channel. Drew and I binge watched him the other night. Just one of the funniest, authentic sneaker guys on YouTube. He does a lot of the cashing out and stuff. He's got a store in Pittsburgh, but uh, I truly believe this is the next guy up with the sneaker cashing out stuff. And uh, he's just authentic, genuine. And what you see is what you get. Just as funny as us, no, not funnier. Yeah, no idea why he's wearing this right now. Why? Listen, viewers, these guys too. I watch a lot of YouTube too. It is so nice to meet genuine people in this game who are actually funny, who care about the culture, and who worry for you guys, seriously. I don't miss a video, ever. I love watching these guys, so informative, and they got a good filter too. Daddy doesn't got a big filter, but I love it. Seriously, comment hype and to the moon, baby. Hey, and we'll be seeing Neeks at a lot more events, so you guys will see him. A lot more events, and you can also find Neeks on WhatNot, which is the sponsor of this video. Neeks. He Shout out one. to Gabe. What's up, Gabe? <laughs> Early bird, part two, this time at SneakerCon in San Antonio. Uh, you guys have seen some of these shoes, some of them you haven't seen yet. Uh, you guys know they come with the early heat. Ian, 
Let's go down. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start. Let's just start here. We'll work our way down. Perfect. So newest, this, this the newest. is the newest. This is our microwave. Okay, wait. Yeah. I, yeah have y'all seen, seen? Have y'all seen the video? I've seen it. Okay. Newest to the nest. Newest to the nest. So this is actually a thermal shoe. So you can actually see if you heat it up. If you go outside in the heat. The whole shoe will actually turn into a But what you don't color. do is you do not microwave don't it like microwave we did. The shoe. Don't microwave it. It will the catch shoe. on fire. Travis's, we've shown you guys all of these Travis's, but I just bought this one just to complete the set. So now we have okay. both trainers. What are your thoughts on, on the brown? Which one do you like more, first off? I like the blue more. This one? I, this yeah. brown's a little weird. It's, it's a little, like harder, a little to purple, yeah. Yeah. harder to wear. Yeah. You guys know Travis is notorious for doing the brown yeah. colorway. Yeah, so I feel like it's only right with a new silhouette that he comes that's, with a brown one. That's for sure. That's yep. And the cool thing about this one is it came with the box. Yeah, we got box. This one got the box on it. OGL yeah. on that. Next, we have the Maison Chateau Rouge. This is Jordan 2. So this year, Jordan's coming with, it's a year of two, right? Year so we two. got a lot of twos coming. And you can see. Leads to the next one, the Armand Manier 2. Is as well. Great way to throw that one in there. <laughs> we actually did this with all of our employees, right? We ranked, there's a three, there's a two, and there's a one, right? Which one is your order from best to worst? On the all mom and years. On the all mom and years. Three, one, two. Three, that's what that's we did. Everybody's that's everybody's. I feel like that's consensus. So yeah. fire, Typically bro. Typically everybody's choice. How do you feel about the colorway on these? Top. You like these? A little harder to wear, but the details on all of the stuff they do, especially the mids. Like the mids are now, yeah, the mids now, are now tell me a history real quick about, about this shoe. Yeah, so so Mason Chateau Rouge, it's um he's from he's got a store in Paris, right? He's from Senegal. His whole his heritage from Senegal. So everything on the shoe, the patterns, the everything on it is African, Taken right? From Senegalese Taken from Africa. culture. And if you so, see on this one it says the United Youth International. So there's some kind of tie to that. We don't know what that is, but <laughs> On the other pair, it says Chicago, Dakar, Paris. So Paris is where his store is. Dakar is where his family is from in Senegal. And then you have the last one, Chicago, which is for the oh, actual shit. ship. Now these, we've already seen the Blazers. We've also seen the Air Forces. Larry, you want to talk about it? This is this is an Ian. Ian's yeah. got to break this down because so th I, I, when I when I, every time I see these or even the um, any of the other pairs, I always think of the Ian. New York episode. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So, so so this reminds me a lot of like your Clivers, your Strange yeah. Loves, right? The only thing I'm very sad about is this is a women's shoe, which means it's not going into my size. And not to mention, right. it's also not releasing from what we've been told because it's supposed to release I've, I've seen in a, December. Yeah, I've seen a rumor for April now. Is what okay, seen. so they pushed it Last time it was just kind of a rumor. We didn't yeah. know. We yeah. thought they were going to release last year because we have seen we saw some early pictures and whatnot. Right. And we thought it would be a Christmas drop, but and then the Christmas, it, Christmas my favorite came, yeah. part of the whole shoe. And All the snowflakes, snowflakes that are falling. Exactly. And then also the distribution tag. What does it say on there when it was made? Uh, so this came out in July. They, or they started making it in July last year. Last year. So. so it was made for Christmas. So what we have here is a premium quality Air Force brought to you by your boy Drake. So here you've got the hit that says love you forever on the side and you can tell that the quality on this leather is very, very premium. It reminds me of the John Elliott Air Force that they released in 2018 where you could just tell all of the stitching, everything is super on point. You got the knock to hit there in the you sole. It's almost like part. lambskin on the insole yeah. if you feel. And you gotta show my favorite part wow. of this entire shoe right here. All the stars have been changed into hearts. So certified lover boy, boy all, the, all the stars are hearts now. And that's why they're actually saying that this shoe may not come out is because the quality control on it, there's not enough pairs that are passing quality checks with the hearts. So they're saying it, they may just scrap the whole yeah, thing. Now, oh. something about the way they look when they're printing out, like some of them aren't getting the full, the way that they're supposed to look. And so they're having to now, upgrade them. We also compared it to a actual premium Air Force, and this is premium, premium. The leather is completely different from the ones that they released last year for like, what was it, $110, I believe, yeah, for the premiums. Yeah, premium. So this is definitely gonna be a higher end shoe. I'm gonna pick up this one because uh, yeah, there it is. From last time. Last time. you sleeping, bro. Like You're still, sleeping. Like These are- Have you seen the other colorway? Uh, no, There's I haven't seen it. also a black, it has these same kind of like patterns, panelings, but I black. love this colorway. Like yeah. Alright, this is, these are nice. Okay. I, I'm, these okay. are going in my toe, for okay. sure. Bri, what do you think? Listen, all I'm going to say is we said it once and we'll say it again, they're still fire. Yeah. Right. That's what I say. Always, seeing them in hand, I love them in even all, more. In all reality, it kind of reminds me of like an old polo rugby, and I know you like vintage, so these patterns yeah, right here. Y'all are into vintage. So, so maybe that might be one of the reasons it's a, it's a why. Re vibe. The recycled sole is a little weird to me, but well, at the end of the day, at 
love it. But at the end yeah. of the day, it's, it's it complements with the yeah. colors on it, with everything going on on the shoes. So this is definitely a dope. Okay, pickup. there's no way that you guys tell me you like this next shoe. <laughs> oh yeah, no. Billy Eilish the Air Force Billie One. Billy Eilish Air oh, Force no. I. Why do they no, do that? Okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Michael likes him. He's Michael Billie, loves Billy. He's Billy. Oh yeah, he's Billy. He traveled to Billy Eilish's first concert for this new tour set and in, sat a rain in the coat. rain in the front of the line for how many hours i was there for three days scoping it but once the line formed i made sure i was first it was like he's in billy eilish fan clubs that they all talk together <laughs> and they figure out who's gonna stand it's in instagram line group chat. It's okay it's an instagram <laughs> billy eilish group chat where they all stand to, they talk about <laughs> no what order in line they're gonna be i just want to say this is not a shoe for me but I respect it. <laughs> all right, all right, fair enough. Wait, I have to know, is Full Fit Larry digging these? I gotta Listen, know. I lived in LA for a long time and I appreciate the Cortez, but it's just not for me. Really? It's just wow. not fair. for me. Fair. I love this shoe, but I'm typically the one where I can take something like this and it's like, I'm gonna, like those, the Sean Wather spoons I had on yesterday. I'll normally figure something out, but this one is just not, it's not for me. I see Larry switching up in the future on these. Yeah. I really do. I totally gonna, see it. He's gonna have the high socks and everything, bro. Have I already union know it. shirt, union <laughs> pants, union, <laughs> union socks, yeah. infrared. Infrared. We talk, you guys love this, right? I love it. I got some nice ones coming That's to that. This, so this one right here. This is a little bit different. Now, this one for me, the reason why I like this one the most is because it's the white and the cream. A lot of times when you put white on and you want to wear a cream hat, it just doesn't look right matching. No, they're, now that they're you have the thing. now that yeah. you have the two together, I can wear my cream hat with the white shirt it's and be so comfortable fun. with wearing these shoes. I'm glad they didn't mess this up because the green ones have a weird so, sparkle. But it, that black, yeah. the black ones that same glossy thing. Though. It's, just, it, it, yeah. it's the same gloss. It's almost looks like a leather, right? But, the, but it's more glossy. A little better. It's more yeah. glossy. The, 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 the green is so bad. Yeah. This is gonna be one of my first that I pick up. That's a dunk high. That just like a regular gr dunk high. This will be one of my first grabs. We talked about the SBs. We talked about these. We haven't talked about Marina Blue. How do you put that? Yeah, is, nice. I see. It's you, great tone. Everyone needs size store. runs of these. This, okay, I got size runs of this in, right? It sold out instantly. Dude, the these are a hitter. Instantly. Yeah. And they're dropping the Kermits also, which is kind of like a green. I don't know if you've seen the different yeah, green. We got, we got a couple. We've got they a Kermit. So oh, they hey. got it. Uh -huh. <laughs> but, <laughs> These are the Philly SBs. So this Look is on the back of the tongue. You this year the is the 75th anniversary of the uh, MLB. So just like last year was oh, the 75th cool. of the NBA, now we're coming with a lot of Let's MLB go. shoes this year. I like that. Now on the alternate one, it's going to be the Liberty Bell, yeah. and then also bubble gum bubble for the gum. MLB. Like MLB Let's two, go. you know, so MLB two. Do you guys get the uh, the Jackson the. The well, Jackie Robinson jet? No, I'm not, yet, not, yet, not, yet, yet. not yet. Those are sick, though. Those are. I thought you had those on for a second. And then y'all seen both of these already. These. So. That's it. We're wrapping it up. That that concludes this early bird special. <laughs> okay, real quick. Everybody's favorite one. All starts. Oh. Duh. Uh, okay. Duh. All right. okay. Go ahead. Oh man, I got. Food. I mean, mine's easy. Throw me that. Drizzy. Gotta go these. Drizzy, bro. Okay. That's easy. Yeah, yeah, Drake, yeah, all day. Yeah, I'm with you. Drake, all day. Now, if we're going with just the ones we just showed you, I gotta go to the Chateau, bro. Yeah, I just feel like these colorways are hard as hell. Larry's been rocking with Sibilis. Yes, I need sir. this. I'll buy it. <laughs> Bry? Yeah, Chavi? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Chavi love it. Right. Love it. Love it. <laughs> part two, comment down below if you guys want a part three here with Private Selection. Maybe you won't have the early birds for yeah, part three. Show some the brain has been stepping yeah. it up, baby. Yeah. Yeah. We got the chlorophylls. Yeah. Or what no, the Kermits? Are they called Kermits or chlorophylls? Yeah. We call them the chlorophylls. I think they're called I think the Probably the colorway is called chlorophyll, but the, oh. like the nickname. Well, if you guys want those, you can shop at my comma shop 24 hey, 7. Hey, hey. <laughs> you bring any with you? No, no. Hey. Not the early bird. I didn't know you didn't have them. At the next sneaker con, you guys just need to act. They're very respectful. Yeah, they're very respectful. respectful man. So you gotta like, bring me one, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you gotta right, flex on okay. him when you get one. All right, all right, all right, all right, I got you. If you know we don't have it, we'll buy it. Tell him, Larry, we'll buy it. I'll buy it. <laughs> Appreciate it, guys. Yes, Thank sir. You. Thank you, guys. Of course. Always a pleasure, man. Enjoy. Yep. Let's get back oh, yes, to the later. craziness. All right, last but not least, we have Bo. Give it to him. Hi, guys. Got the off-white. Uh, I think it's the Miami. I don't know. I don't know. The back is, the reason why I bought it is because the back is pretty nice. Uh, just some black shorts and then uh, the off-white 90s, the OGs. I actually hit these for retail when I was in calculus 2017. I did not drop out, but- How many did you drop out? <laughs> you are? Yeah, community college dropout. I did not do well in that class. Yeah. Big but math I, guy, huh? But I was, mm, I don't know, I mean, two, Big plus numbers two, is, guy. two plus two is three, so anyway. But uh, it's just good to be here. Good to see you guys as always, you know. Welcome to Texas. Yeah, so the thing is that, guys, the common hype, they they the best one giving out advices for whoever wants to make extra bread. Like myself, I started like because I wanted some extra money, but then in a year, it became a side hustle. I started with $100 and now I have like, $20,000, $15,000 worth of shoes. I stopped working and I'm paying my bills out of 
all the advice that y'all be telling me. And honestly, y'all put me on. I'm grinding and growing up in New York. So That's you guys up, are not. Very big congrats to you. As Johnson would say, there's people who see this and they're just like, wow, that's super cool. But there's very little people who actually take action, you know, yeah. from what kind of we talk about and the investments and stuff. No, and and you're one of those people who like take it. Say, yeah, of course. So buy, sell, buy, sell. Yeah. And yeah, like I wanted to sell you yeah, but like it's complicated. So yeah, you know that there's sure. other ways to get money. Sure. But all the people who go buy it out there in New York. Don't sell the less unless you're desperate, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Should be the last. Should, should be your last resort. Nah, bro. nah, that's what I do. I try to sell it for whoever pay the most, the highs, and whatever's easier for me. Sure. And basically, I do the same thing y'all do. Now, I stop selling and I'm buying now. So, yeah. I'm, that's what's up, bro. I, I always go into the next level. So, heck yeah. Uh, y'all are gonna be the next. I don't know, Virgil. <laughs> Nike should hire you. No, him. don't put his. <laughs> don't move in the same name as Virgil uh, for you, sure. You guys are gonna be way too big. I appreciate the kind words. I mean, you're sitting at home, you got a hundred bucks. This guy did it, which means you can do it too. So, so shout out to you, bro. Congrats on everything. Congrats. All right, wow, what a sneaker con it's been. Bo not only sold a ton of slides, but he was slaying in merch for us, holding it down when we were doing the whatnot Stop. stuff. Hey, so thank bro. you very much. Anytime, love you boys. We had a great time. I, I, I'm sure you already talked about it. This show was actually insane. It was nuts. The love was nuts. They you know, were talking about it earlier. Texas really shows some love down here, and so that's a God blesses for me just, because this is where I'm from. So yeah. It just validates that we love Texas, and it's, it's been awesome. So huge shout out to the city of San Antonio. Thank you to Sneaker Con for having us. Thank you to Whatnot for sponsoring this video. And thank you to you guys for tuning in. Remember, five pairs of Air Force Ones we are giving away in this video for only a dollar. Hit the link in the pinned comment down below and then make sure you guys join Whatnot for $10 off your future purchase. From Bryson behind the camera, from myself, from Drew, from the entire Common Hype team, we thank you guys as always for supporting us and uh, we'll see you in the next Cash Out video.